welcome to day one of Seven Days of Congress. Yay! I'm so excited to be back to Seven Days of Congress. I feel like I just finished filming last year's Seven Days of Congress, but I am back indeed. This is going to be day one, the ranch riding and raining, and then every consecutive day will be a different look for a different class. So that's what today is. If you are interested in getting an appointment at the Quarter Horse Congress, I will leave my information down below. It's on www.horseshowbeauty.com. Um, but yeah, you can schedule appointments through there, and I have limited availability especially on showmanship days but see what I have left and you can definitely grab a spot so let's get into this so I did start with my eyes primed I'm using wherever I put it the eyeshadow primer potion in the color Eden haha <laughs> from Urban Decay here I'm gonna try to start every day using that that will already be on my base will be on my brows will be on the base I will have filmed this is gonna be the prequel day of seven days of Congress I it's just the bronzer blush contour no not blush highlight contour, bronzer, foundation, primer, concealer, powder, all this. So those will be there. These videos are going to be just the eyes, the lips, and then a blush that I put on. So for today's look, I'm going to be using the Soft Glam Palette by Anastasia. This is one of my favorites, and it just has lots of brown kind of colors in it. Great for every day for any look. You can make so many different looks with this palette, but for the ranch lighting, I like to keep it more in the brown kind of tones. I'm going to start with the color Orange Soda on a fluffy blending brush and put this into the crease. Next, I'm going to take... So I started with orange shadow. I'm going to take Burnt Orange on a JH35 with the Morphe Cosmetics. It's also a M433. Same brush, just part of Morphe and Jaclyn Hill's collection. So I'm putting this just on the outer corner. And then I'm taking it into the crease like halfway. Kind of winging out this outer corner as well. On that same brush, I'm going to take a little bit of Sienna. Put this in pretty much the same area, just adding depth. Now I'm going to take a JH34 brush, it's a more pointed tapered blending brush and I'm going to go into the color Rustic. I'm going to put this on the outer corner as well, kind of the same place, building different layers. Then I'm just going back in with my big fluffy blending brush and blending the edges. I'm going to take that same brush with the same color and run it on the lower lash line. It's about halfway kind of connecting the top and the bottom lash line. You could totally leave it just like this and put some lashes, mascara, whatever you want on. Today I'm going to use a little bit of glistening. I'm going to first spray my brush. This is a really pretty, um, like kind of duochrome color. Then just taking my brush and blending out the edge here. Then I'm taking a little bit of fairy just on my finger and putting this on the inner corner. I am so tempted to add lashes and liner, but for ranch riding, I really don't feel like many people are going to do like a big wing liner and lashes, so I'm just going to put on some mascara really quickly. Here I'm using Lancome Monsieur Big. Then I'm taking Monsieur Big Waterproof for my lower. For blush today, I'm using Taj Mahal from NARS. This is an IT Cosmetics 316 brush. And then my absolute favorite product to do for lips is these Josie Marin. Infinity Argon Infinity Lip and Cheek Creamy Oil. It's a stain, however, I know they don't make these anymore, so I feel like a total mean person putting it on right now. Um, but I know sometimes that Josie Marin's products are on Hot Look and they'll have this. And then also, I know YSL makes a stain, Benefit makes a stain, Sephora Collection has a stain. Um, so just kind of find a color that you like. Alright everyone, here is the completed look for the ranch riding and raining portion of 7 Days of Congress. So I just paired it with my Shorties straw hat. You can get straw hats anywhere, but I love mine from Shorties. And then a gray button up. Honestly, I didn't really have a shirt that went with this eye look, because I do a lot of like purple and black and gray, so yeah, but wear whatever you have, it does not matter. I just like to do like my eyes are kind of warm tones, so oranges and yellows. And then I have a gray shirt, which is very cool tone. So if you have something that goes with your eye look, great. Or rather, why don't you match your eye look to your clothes? But anyways, so this is going to be the day one of seven days of Congress. This is the ranch riding and rainy. I was about to say trial. <laughs> Honestly, I'm not sure what I'm going to make day two and three yet, but stay tuned. I know I'm going to have a Hunter Under Saddle, a Pleasure, a Day Off type of look, kind of the same as last year. If you'd like to see last year's playlist, I will link that down below as well. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's video, day two. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel, follow all of my social media, Instagram, Facebook, all of them are at Horseshit Beauty, and I will see you guys tomorrow.
Bye, guys.